my question for the week, and let me make sure I'm going to say, make sure I get it right. <clears throat> Pull out the old Uh-oh. handy dandy notes. Okay, so my question is: Do 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 either do y'all believe that uh, the state of women is a byproduct of men and our behaviors, men and our behaviors? And so where I came to this is like like we we as men like have a lot of negativity and a lot of criticism at this point, which and then I'm not saying it warranted or, or, or unwarranted, but I'm just saying that there's a lot of uh, criticism that's going around, and I'm I, I know I got my part, and even like. Off of the off of the pod, like talking with the homies, we go talk. We, you know, we all vent to each other, and we have a lot of critiques uh, for women at this point. And I got to thinking, you know what I mean? And I'm sitting there like, dang, I know some some dudes that like they done scarred some women. They yeah. I know a lot of dudes that done scarred women, and you know that of course that 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 lived experience will be experienced by another man down the line. You know what I mean? So I was just wondering, like, how do what do you think about that? Do you think that that the 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 state that they are in or the mentality that they have now is and which we, the of course this is a generalization we're not everybody is, doesn't fit in this idea or whatever idea uh, do you think that that is a byproduct of our actions and what we what we said we liked and and do you think that that nah, is a thing uh, I do because uh, I mean if you I mean if you're gonna go by you know like biblical terms religious terms I think the man is the leader or supposed to be like a, a spiritual leader mm. in in the house and so i think when they used to target the blacks like the the the, the men like if you take the men out and, and you put us on a bad path i think the rest of the community is just going to follow mm. and i think the state of our community is just a reflection of where men you know have been i don't think it's a current reflection i think it's always like a couple years later that like if you got like a bad generation of dudes then five ten years later you'll see that reflect in the women Mm. of that community and and vice versa so i do think like a lot of the women that we're seeing now is based on like how the dudes were acting in the early 2000s the old you know back in high school and how we used to just be real reckless with just the approach to dealing with women, I think you're seeing it reflect in how women are now treating and approaching guys. So I would say it's, I don't know if it's 100% our fault, but we definitely played a part in getting us to where we are now. For sure. I actually been waiting for this conversation for a minute because I've thought, I've thought about this for a while. Like, <laughs> I'm crazy. Yeah, I've I, I thought about this for a minute, man. But um, I, I, I've kind of maintained this for a while that I think, like, regardless whether people want to admit it or not, there are certain things that are just true and they are what they are. And I think one of those things is that men are the leader, whether we're leading to worse or better. Mm. So I think like um, one of the things that I was thinking about was like, okay, that, like w- around the time, even I was thinking about this around the time Nicki Minaj came out even like, um, but just thinking about like how that transition of music happened, you had this transition of music and it was one day that I was sitting there, it, it occurred to me that before we got these artists, there was men that was pushing the women to make this kind of music. Like, like, or, and even the music that they was making, like the, the stuff that we was talking about within the music, we went from like in the 70s and the 80s and even the 90s talking about loving women and everything to like the 90s it went to, you, you got a whole bunch of bees and hoes, like, and not that this stuff, that it didn't exist on the underground circuit, but I'm saying the majority of what you heard was mm-hmm. not disrespect. Like it was a lot of love that was going on in like the 70s, 80s, even early 90s. Mm-hmm. Then it transitioned to this whole thing of, I got hoes in different area codes and further than like mm-hmm. just just that whole era of music and everything and it was fun but there oh, was also the music i'm not i'm not just blaming music but i'm saying music the, the, played a part though but, music played a part tv was, played a part hold on, had, hold on hold on hold on and, and, and this is your this is your uh get your get, get, get yours off real quick like music play a part tv play a part all of all of like the propaganda plays a part in how we end up conducting ourselves whether we admit it or not there are people who are purposely funding this stuff for the purpose Mm-hmm. Of okay, because th- we see how this this affects in other areas. So what I'm saying is like what ended up happening. You had you had a whole bunch of men who was pushing women to to do like we was glorifying these women. Mm-hmm. We was glorifying the hoes. We was glorifying the women who was about doing promiscuous things. We was glorifying the women who's at the clubs doing like. In order for a woman to be virtuous, she's not going to be able to be amongst all of these guys all the time. You're not going to really find a virtuous woman amongst that. 
Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah, mm-hmm. uh, but, 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 but a lot of it has to do with like our actions too, because yeah. like- I it, think it all got to do with it, our it, actions. It, it, yeah. Like outside of the music, the, the movies and even all of that, you, it was actually music, dudes in them clubs cheating on or, 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 do, or, or, or doing whatever and like leaving a good girl alone. Like e- e- even I was a victim of it back in the day. You leave a good girl alone for like the girl that was going to bust it open for you. You because said you were the victim of it? Oh yeah, I I I was my control. I tried to get off on that one. That's I was my control's propaganda. Like I was a victim. Like they had all the, you know, all the rappers with their pants sagging and all 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 the vulgar language and the music. <laughs> <laughs> he really playing big. But, no, hey, but no, you know, no, you know, no, something no, too no, that's no. also crazy is that, like, even when we talk about like the music, where the the most of the like the, the a lot of that female uh, more dominant, dominating, and, and masculine sounding music that that they it's written by men. Mm-hmm. Most of that stuff is written by men, and then, then just think about so we take it all the way back. It, so you said same thing. Women can take it all the way back to. Uh, if we take it all the way back to like where we heard a lot of the stories about how our mothers and mm-hmm. grandparents were uh, treated, you know what I mean? How that to do with you, your grandmother was probably, well, we all thought our grandmothers was the ones in the right the whole time, but let's just say that she was, you know what I mean? Cool. And, you know, collected. And he was, you know, tricking, going and getting another little side piece that was in the streets, running the street. At, at the gamble house. You, you know, know what I mean? So it's literally like we have co-signed the behavior for a long time. We've co-signed the behavior and, and now they're pretty much just saying, fuck it, we're going to take, you know what I mean? We're going to have pride in the behavior that the men that, that we won't have wanted the entire time. Mm-hmm. Well, they so there the is, a, and that's what I kind of thought about. I was like, there is a good bit of blame that we have to uh, wear for it. Um, even though, like I still there's critiques, you know what I mean? There are critiques to be, to Ooh, be said, yeah, but like, yeah. we definitely have, uh, and I'm speaking this, when I say we, of course, we're making that generalization as we are the, the topic in, in, in its entirety. But um, there's a good bit of even like, you know what I mean, the, the, what, is something that, what I would say like the toxic masculinity joint when you're younger is like, get as many as you can. Yep. Get as many as you can. And then amongst your boys, you ain't doing nothing if you ain't got as many as you can get. But let me I can ask get you more this. than you can get. No, Did you fall and, victim to that? Yeah, I was a victim. Oh, he was a victim. Okay. I was a victim we too. All victims. Yeah, <laughs> I was a victim <laughs> too. All the victims. I'm, That's I'm, what I'm saying. I was just I'm, I'm not saying we. You ain't hear me. We <laughs> saying we. I didn't ask the question. I just stood out there. Victim. I stepped what up we first. Do, what we do? All the fuckboy victims out there, but I, I, I will be a voice. What we do is let you <laughs> an hey, advocate. Hey, throw the blame up one generation. Just keep throwing it up a generation. Yeah, we just products of what they was doing. Oh yeah, mm-hmm. and and like and 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 here's the thing, like. Like, even when we talking about the Will and Jada thing, like, it goes back to, like, I, I could even, like, wrap this into this as far as, like, how, like, when, when we bring that into the context of, like, our, our our grandparents and, like, today's women, like, have a chance to, like, have an opportunity to do stuff that, like, our grandmothers couldn't. Mm-hmm. And they're just taking advantage of it just based on them feeling, you know, neglected, betrayed for, for, for years. And then now they're, like, well, I have the opportunity to do this, and like if it was the other mm, way around, why should I take their feelings into account if my feelings were never taken into in, in, into account? And that's how you get, you know, uh, somebody like a Jada, and like and, and when you say but you said Tupac was doing a crazy, not Will, or I don't know who was doing her crazy. Will was doing her crazy. I thought she was doing Will crazy, and that was a byproduct. Well, me, well, yeah, it probably was, it probably was Tupac, and then. But 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 what I was gonna they say, love the fuck, nigga. but but what I was gonna they, say though, they be the good guy, like these 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 women that we're complaining about, there's always somebody like running behind them that's mm-hmm. like in love mm-hmm. with that shit, like like, like even sure. like a Jada, Will went up there and like no matter how bad she did him, you say one little corny joke about it, he'll smack you in the face on live it, TV. On, on live TV in mm-hmm. front of millions of people, so yeah. like that behavior is still being like reward or or, or, or 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 they have a justification to continue doing that because there's always a dude that's going to be there making it seem right or or, or, or riding for that behavior mm-hmm. you know will like and so that's why i think it, it is no matter how you look at it it's always kind of a product of our behavior and our encouragement or support mm-hmm. you know of of what they're doing um to answer the question i would say 
I guess yes. I think typically, well, I'll speak directly to the question first. Um, I say yes because uh, I think it comes down to simply we either accept bad behavior or we're forcing bad behavior. Um, that can be seen in the sense of like we dislike the independent woman, like moniker, but it comes from something that mm-hmm. was a forced thing. Um, we we say that we don't like like the specific. Whether it's like dotting around or the eyelashes or makeup or whatever. But if you accept a certain level of that behavior, as a group in general, that behavior is going to continue to, to go and, and be. Um, but I, I also say, I think that this is just like an Hold either on, but or. But I don't think we should do, let's not go on to the other side of it. This was, I, I wanted this to be strictly about our accountability to what we have kind of created. I don't want to flip it. I know it's easy. We could flip it the other way. Is that what you were going to do? We could flip it. Well, yeah, I'm about to say, like, bo- I know we know it goes vocal, but you I don't want to go that way. Niggas that is trapping. They don't want to go that way. I want to keep it on us. But I go ahead. Keep it on us. Yeah, we ain't. We, 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 yeah, we, 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 we done gave up. Uh, you, you done body shamed old girl earlier. And, I ain't body shamed nobody. Body shamed her earlier. <laughs> You know what I mean? Let's I not let's not go back to it. Hey, let's, bro, let's, I ain't let's, body shaming. I just said she don't miss no shaming. she don't miss no yams, bro. You better body shaming. She, <laughs> she don't miss no she don't miss no mac and cheese. That's all I said. I don't miss no mac and cheese either. Me neither. Neither. Just just being not honest, no like, mac and not missing Claire, no mac what? and cheese. <laughs> um, unless, but, it's in the box, unless it's out the box, I miss that nowadays as a grown. I miss that. I miss that. The out the box mac and cheese. Yeah, the cr- the little box where it's got the cheese. You don't like the out the box? I'm cool. Nah. I'm cool on it now. I, I mean, I'll miss that. I see point. what he's saying. I I I'll, I, I'll, I'll skip a Velveeta yeah. you know, joint like every. Nah, I, 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 are y'all saying y'all don't miss it or y'all miss it? We say no, we, we will, will miss, miss the it. meal. We'll skip. Oh, we'll be all right on it. Like you saying, oh. somebody never missed no meals. We saying we'll miss that meal. Oh, okay, all right. Then, the then we're all together. Big Mac, yeah. I'm not missing that mac and cheese. Oh yeah, y'all don't rock with the Velveeta. Yeah, I miss it. Oh, her tone was. I miss the Velveeta. I go in the store and get the dollar, bro. Bro got a box at the crib right I, there. I'm right this second. I just go get it when I need it. But I get that Velveeta, throw some dog on sharp cheddar in there. You know what's the problem with the Velveeta? It. It's not even. It's the it's the noodles. I don't like the little. Oh, you must be boiling them too long. Well, no, I don't like the smaller noodles. They got the smaller noodles in the Velveeta. I don't really like. I like the big chunky joints. Shoot, I like the crab too. That's like that used to be a good. Yeah, man. I'm just gonna say. I, I honestly, I prefer bait, this, but I don't this, discriminate against the dog on box. Yeah, this place, bro, okay, mac and cheese, me, mac and cheese, me, bro. Um, cool. but I guess like if we if we circle it back to it, uh, I don't know. Like I said, I think that either we condone behavior, um, allow behavior, or force behavior, uh, as a sex as men. And if you want change, like you kind of hold the, the the key to that, depending on what you actually accept, or you make sure that you don't force or allow. So, what would you say behaviors guys should do if we wanted to change the behaviors of the women? What would that look Ooh, like, buddy? That looks like what a real behavior looks like today. Uh, oh, start yeah, with Jeremy. It, it's funny because that kind of goes into like remember I asked this uh. I think somebody had some smoke for me. Well, we didn't actually go into it. it. Was like, do you think that we should that indecent women should be treated than decent, different than different than differently than decent women? And somebody had smoke for that. But I literally, this kind of where we are now, at least in my mind, that the only way that we could we would have to only provide the benefit to the 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 answer to the you know what I mean to so the you should only be to the productive to some women to the productive uh the productive side of it because if. If we are to give the other other side of it any attention, then it's still going to just lag itself on and on and on and on. So you would literally have to remove that from your preference. Your preference would literally have to be uh, recreated, um, in my opinion. I guess I, I guess I, I don't necessarily go that route. I think that if we become better men, we we have we have the ability to. Uh, require better women mm-hmm. i think it's, it's kind of it's kind of simple as that 100%. where um again if we're not making single mothers and we're staying with our kids so and we're like that becomes a, a, a issue that is solved yeah, i can't i can't um if if you That's don't rough. if like so if there's no male accountability to single motherhood i guess it, i don't know i guess it, it's tough to me because we do choose the woman we do take the condom off we do we do like like we control all these parts. We're mating with that person. But then that goes to like what kind of woman are you choosing? And what like what 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 things do you actually allow that like I guess it's it's a tough word to use, but like the person no, it's not a tough word because of when you're 
the person that you end up dating is a person that meets certain standards. And those are the standards that you allowed it to be. Well, I mean, and, that would be, that would, that would be like saying if you drop you would, off anybody, then you then 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 you they should be over certain. And my thing is, no, like, like, like you just don't like, reward certain shit. Like, but it's but my thing is that is that what age is or that? talking to them or, or in general? It, it would be nah, something that had to be taught at a younger thing. age because like huh? it would it would be something that would have to be taught at a younger age because the mature mind can make that decision and understand the venom process as the as a mature man. But like before before you were this matured man. You done definitely went and done some things with over. some people that you wouldn't dare touch today. Uh, but all right, so but that's what I'm saying. Like, uh, cause the only the only solution is going to be like in in like a very uh, optimistic uh, world where like men is going to have to have like a, a trans. I don't think that like this world's about to happen or anything. Oh yeah, like we that. we know. That's uh, and, and that's what I'm saying. Like we're yeah. we're and yes, Tony. You, you I was about to say, I was agreeing with you. It would take a value in men's. That, like men would have to change the the value what they value, and it's the same thing that already happened. It's kind of like the reverse of what we already seen happen. Yeah. Because like you look back at the sixties, they valued different things, and mm. the women conducted themselves differently because yeah. of what See, those men it valued. Was, I think it, it was, was quality over the... quantity. Where now guys care about like how many joints you get. Damn. They still had some quantity, but it was like you you was considered a certain way. Like like it was the standard that you was looked at a certain way. If you was dressed like this, or if you was carrying yourself like this, there was certain standards that was like shame. Where did them the standards thing is come from? Whatever uh, uh, the other people, sex. Where did rewards. them standards come from? I do wonder where them standards came from. I would say where some, did which like, standards come from? Um, basically, like some of the standards in the past, as far as um, I would definitely say it was the church. It was definitely the church house, bro. But we that's a whole nother conversation. Uh oh. <laughs> it was the church house. Uh oh. That's a whole nother conversation. I'm gonna say y'all uh y'all y'all got it all out. I'm good. Oh, was it mm-hmm. there? Oh. You you good? Mm-hmm. Uh well then if that's the case, I'll go ahead and, you know, put a pin on it. 